we are going to cut off any hand that is holding Biafra not to come. Biafra army. Hmm. Hello, my wonderful people. They say there is a serious uh, plane crash in Lagos State. Unfortunately, nobody died. Mm -hmm. They say some Biafra Nigerians in Pakistan has been humiliated by Pakistan police. Hello, my wonderful people. Welcome back to Balabas Juice. If today is the first time you are coming across this wonderful channel, you are highly welcome. Um, don't forget to go and subscribe to our YouTube channel for a quick update for that side. Remember, I said the information, I be the cure. Um, the reason why you have to subscribe to our channel, and I be say anytime where you know find out for this page, you will dare use it to find us for that channel. Okay, and don't forget to follow this page as well as the heart. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to turn on your, not your notification bell for quick update as well. Because if you post, you will be the first person to get that. Okay, man, we'll come back to look into the Obenga news where we we'll get for hand today. Hmm. And uh, one Biafra Liberation Army, don't come outside. Paro, he say the way the Igbo people and the uh, other Biafras they do things, you know, good. Say they supposed to come to talk to them, may they know the things where they go they do so that Biafra go quickly come, but rather they know they do them. And say for other tribe, we be Yoruba like Hausa, say the Yoruba and the Hausa they go meet all those Boko Haram, they, they negotiate with them, they give them money, may they, they do work <laughs> where they like. And the Tunumbu, now be the master of Aburu, and they, they settle Aburu for, uh, for, as well. But our own people, they will give them money, they come back on the fight their own people. Hmm, they'll be smarting. Uh, he went ahead and said that uh, they no go agree. He said this time around, they don't raise their arm for up. Anybody will pull hand. <laughs> he said they go cut the hand, come out. <laughs> uh, he said so many things. And for this video, we will show you. And then uh, may you watch them from beginning to end. Then we will come back, we will continue. I have a whole logo. I hate to do it. I don't know what I'm doing. You are the one doing it to your house. You don't want to do it. I'm going to make them mad. The vice president of this Zualocha country, are he not the one visiting the Boko Haram? You don't ask yourself a question. Now, to know who the governor of the nation, the father of Ado, Papanda Ado, are you not aware? Are yeah, you people not aware of what I'm saying? The father of Agboro, he is here now, celebrating your bus. And you are here killing your people. You are here planning a way to scatter the life of your, your, your youth, the grown up world. Do you think that we don't know what to do? Do you think that we don't have to have, have something hard to do in life? At least I was once a soldier man. Look at me today. I'm fighting for my freedom. And that freedom all I know. And Biafra must be our nation. Because they are my nation. I strongly believe these days, all the young what I will like to do, I have to check a car. Before God and Mama, I was in a court, I will come. In a court, I will cut the hand. Come with the reality. I must cut off the hand. That's what I must cut off the hand. That's what I believe. And I strongly believe that two people who can't be a man, they are going to go to the house. I'm going to go yeah my wonderful people you yeah, highly welcome back as i've watched that video and they had everything that i said earlier he also said it here on this particular video um you know certain things are really happening sometimes uh, even though the, even though you see madman on the road 
they are really making sense because the situation in the country now have given everybody sense not be smarting um now you are going to i'm going to leave you for you to contribute to and leave your own opinion in this particular video um truly they are making sense in their own world because we have seen it several um uh, where you see all those houses meeting Boko Haram, negotiating with them and that these people are killing people like flies and they have not go and bombard them like they have done in so many times say they are fighting instant security network you see the abros be settling in lagos in yoruba land and in our own side our people will neither go and create some 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 armed men and call them security to come and fight their own brothers uh, that is absolutely rubbish uh, in 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 everything there's a, a stage of negotiation and the negotiation should be the ultimate here okay my people let's go and look into what happened lagos today hmm will be smart in they say that nearly take um, almost how many passengers so many passengers yesterday um, in a plane crash but uh, unfortunately say nothing happened the, the plane missed track and went into a bush so i'm going to show you the video for you to watch then we'll come back and continue don't forget to drop your opinion on the previous on the first video that will show you right now and tell us what you think about what this uh, um, army of freedom is saying this does did it to escape the plane crash. This does did it. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you. In this situation, um, the fear that will come into you <laughs> is imaginable. Uh, but we we'll thank God uh, that nothing actually happened to them, and they all saved. Uh, this happened they say is united uh, uh united air in lagos so um if you are loved one that bought this plane please contact him or her and ask how are you because uh, um they really got really served them in this particular accident uh, and they escaped a uh, really crash okay my people no be smart you know we're going to pakistan go look into it in the happen for that side they say some biafras and some nigeria where they saw that side they face a serious humiliation by the pakistan police uh, we are going to look into the video now and um, see what is going on there. Um, but unfortunately, we are not going to play the whole video but because uh, it's, it's very, uh, in short, it's a violation totally because uh, they are shooting, they shoot someone face to face. Unfortunately, they didn't get the person. So but we are going to play the video uh, for you to watch what is going on in Pakistan, how they are humiliating um, Biafras over there. <laughs> Nigeria, you should see what is happening in Pakistan. See how the Pakistan government is treating us. See how the Pakistan government is treating us. See how the Pakistan government is treating us. This is disrespect, policeman. Policeman are not. Okay, my wonderful people. Now, so we see them for Pakistan. <laughs> they say this one is happening in Pakistan as they have cried out and shout that Nigeria should help them so that we reach out the authorities um, so that uh, the Pakistan government will stop uh, those police who are harassing them on the street uh my people will be smart you know they say uh, everywhere where you go you must see our people hmm, this country don't frustrate people enter different different countries will be say yourself you no know, imagine save our people they there uh not be smart in. so as now don't hear them wanna share the message share and share them may government may everybody may they hear um say some nigerians waiting for inside that place and uh, those people if you watch them very well you will not say they are biafras uh, but uh, in this case nobody will come for them because <laughs> but if say they speak uh, Boboloshi and uh, nakaka nankada hey they will make call and people go call rescue them but in this case we will still try our best to share the video hmm no be smart you know and i saw we see them this morning 
and we we'll go look into the next of Bongo news where we we'll get for hand. They say no be smart in the happen for Taraba State right now. So they talk. Oh, hmm. They say over 40 residents kidnapped, several missing as terrorists enter into 15, 15 community in Taraba State. And uh, this is happening in Nigeria. But the question I'm asking, this energy they are putting in ESN and uh, and they are putting in ESN, Eastern Security Network, and Biafra agitators. What is going on in the north? Why are they not putting it there to fight these people who are killing people like fly? Could you imagine over 40 residents kidnapped, several missing? In 15, in 15 Taraba community, they do this thing. Could you imagine? This is happening in the north. Uh -huh. Now, wow, my people, hmm, we we'll go look into the next of Wenge news where we we'll get for hand. Mm -hmm. Now, be the president candidate, where be Peter will be, he don't come aside. Contour say, ah, he say, my journey to presidency will be painful, difficult, maragot, but uh, um, don't be despair. He tell his supporters, may they not worry. Say, no matter how corrupt, the corner can shine. He said he must get there. He must become the president of uh, Nigeria. And so many people can reply, can the tell and say, hmm, Peter B, you are still a dreamer. Um, joining your brothers to fight would be more better for you to waste your time for the country who don't regard you people as existent upon how what you people have contributed for this country and uh, they just they don't regard you people so join your brother and fight for total freedom and this one said that uh, this one is a dream it will not happen and Nigeria has been taken over uh, by some some bad cabans and they can't come outside in your hand they take only the youth to lead a revolution in other way to re restore the country back. <clears throat> Don't be smart, you know. Now, so we see him now. Say, we'll bring a congivor. Now, I'm going to stay tuned. A lot to read the come out today.